There's some business advice that's blindingly obvious once you know it. Just because somebody has never appeared in your feed before, just because you haven't seen them on telly or on the radio, doesn't mean that they haven't done interesting things and lived interesting lives and might have valuable information to share. For me, I started my first business as a 26 year old. I moved home with my mum and dad to launch what would become a market leading business magazine in my home country, Australia. I funded that with credit cards and personal savings. And it was a wild, wild time and I learnt a whole heap of stuff. Then, of course, the GFC struck. It was the perfect storm for magazines and I was forced to transform my print business into a digital business and we managed to do that. Indeed, Nielsen listed us among the top 50 business and finance websites in Australia based on traffic, beating major newspapers. Everyone wanted to know how I did that. So I ended up on the professional speakers circuit it was a natural hop, skip and a jump into online training. And it wasn't long before I hit $1 million in online sales, which apparently puts me among the top 1% of course creators on the planet. This gave me the freedom to go on wild and crazy adventures to places like Antarctica, where yes, indeed, I did buy two pairs of socks for $300. Now, when you create courses, that's lots of fun. You build a, a big audience. You get very good at teaching and training. Then in early 2020, me and two other people decided that we wanted to create a business specifically for B2B business owners, business to business business owners. And we created the B2B group, which started as the B2B school, then became B2B school plus B2B dash.io. Then that became B2B dash.io, B2B school and the B2B hub. If you're interested in leveling up your B2B skills from someone who has been around the block once or twice, figuratively and literally, click the link in my bio. I'd love to help you out.